right, we got us another Penny with Zero video. This is Porch Pooper Must Be Stopped. Yeah, I had to click the video because I saw the title. I, bruh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Sleeping tonight with this villain I'm about to put on your radar. You will be trying to snooze with one eye open and one eye on your phone looking for any ring doorbell alerts. Because there's a menace on the loose. There's a maniac afoot. And Spongebob isn't here to catch him yet. We're talking about the porch pooper. An elusive, nefarious scoundrel that's leaving undesired presence on the front door so wait, 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 of... Wait, 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 There's a piece of shit on people's porches. And if the nigga has done this more than once, bro, I swear to God. One man in particular at the moment, but... This could be just the beginning of a crime spree. You probably heard of porch pirates, but what about porch poopers? Don't know any other way to say it. I can think of like a hundred other ways to say it. Why didn't you just ask me? But I will say porch pooper, I think is very solid. That's a great alliteration that just flows off the tongue. But I've got some cool names for this cryptid. Feel free to use them. The patio shadio. Spready <laughs> Fazbear. Poop Sp shit man. Spready f what? Wait, wait. The patio shadio. Spready Fazbear. Spready Fazbear is crazy. Poop shit man. I'm partial to poop shit man myself. It sounds like a like the name of a Kojima character, like Die Hard Man. Right now LMPD is looking for a man who has been using the bathroom on Louisville homeowners' porch all week long. You, he did this more, more than once is insane. So he's a serial porch shitter. He's a serial pooper. What are we talking about? All week? You been shitting all week? <laughs> you can't be serious. All First week. nutty professor now this? Serial shitter, bro. <laughs> All week? Gee. Porch Alice tracked down the homeowner and spoke with him about being targeted by a porch pooper. That's the last kind of person you want to be targeted by. That's like being hunted down by Jason Bourne right there. A porch pooper has set his sights on this one homeowner in particular for no reason that they can figure out yet. It seems like random act of shit. Listen. <laughs> Random acts of shit is A crazy. warning. While we won't show you everything, okay? We won't show you everything. Some may be grossed out by this video. When I first watched this, I actually thought this was about to be some kind of like sly plug for their Patreon or something or like exclusive membership content on their YouTube channel. Oh, shit. Look, we're not going to show you everything here, but sub to the Patreon or join on YouTube and you get the full ass blasto experience here ass blasto Poop and all insane. more butt cheek and more feces than you can handle enjoy to your heart's content but it's just her letting viewers know like hey there's a dude fucking <laughs> squatting <laughs> thank you what was that it was cap cut be pottying on this guy's front door and even though we censored it it's still kind of yucky it all started with this. Sunday night, a young man in a red shirt walks up to one Louisville home well after midnight and begins peering inside. The homeowners have no clue. After a few seconds, the man runs away in his socks and disappears into the night. But the next night, he returns and leaves a horrific surprise. There's a lot to unpack here. He like, what? First of all, is he barefoot? Returns and leaves... A horrific surprise. Yo, what's so crazy is he's walking up, pulling his pants, or, or, or like on in the customer pulling his pants. He's barefoot, no socks, and the light is bright. The light is on, chat. The light is fucking on, and you don't give a fuck. You're squatting in front of somebody's house with a bright ass light shining on you, shitting. That nigga, bro, when you catch that nigga, you might need a tranquilizer, bro. That nigga's a shitter. He's a shitter, bro. There's a lot to unpack here. If you ask me, it doesn't seem like he's in his right mind. I, it's, he's got to be under the influence of something, it looks like. 
Because he's approaching the door and he starts doing this with his hands like he's fucking putting binoculars on to see inside of it. About to use x-ray vision or something. I know it's in a... Right! Did he wipe? How the f... What? It don't look like he had tissue on his hand. Did he even fucking wipe? Nah, walking around with shitty itchy booty is crazy. I'm sorry, I don't never want to be that vengeful. I don't even, like... You're, you're, you got shit smeared in your dookie, in, in your, in, in your ass. Just running away. Just in your ass. What are we talking about? Effective strategy when you actually get to the door so you can see in a little bit better and focus. But he was doing it, like, from way too far away for that to be useful at all. And then, of course, you have to be off your goddamn gourd to take a shit on a stranger's doorstep. But what's even weirder about this is that it was a premeditated shitting. It wasn't like some kind of impulse thing where he just had the bubble guts and just couldn't hold it in anymore. The dam broke. He went to the house one night, cased the joint, basically, scoping out the scenery, making sure it's like the optimal place to take a shit. Came back the following night after cooking it up, like charging his alt for 24 hours and then released the payload. Like, he just took the dump the following night. So, this was something that he had planned out from the sound of it. And looking at the footage, he was wearing the same outfit. At least Wait. if this footage is the proper timeline where he went to the house first just looking at everything and then came back the next night taking the shit, he's wearing the exact same clothes, so he didn't even, like, bathe or change in that time. Tuesday morning, I went out to my front, front porch and noticed this what I thought was a cat poop. The homeowner who wishes to remain anonymous but who we'll refer to as Jim then checked his doorbell camera and realized it was no cat at all. And it turned out to be a person. And not only did he- It just he... pulled his pants up. Just pulled them holes up. You nasty as hell. Defecate, but he also urinated on our welcome mat. This seems personal, but and the homeowner- God damn! T All right, yeah, you're different. Shitting before the pee is crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Nigga shitted first, and it was like, ah, oh, pee too. Nigga, you couldn't just pee. You couldn't just pee. Like this wouldn't even been that crazy. Like, yeah, still peeing on somebody's doorstep is insane. But this wouldn't, even bro. This nigga shitted first. Shitted first. You know you have to strain to shit. You have to strain. So you didn't felt you had to pee. It was like, might as well do that here too. Owner Jim has no idea who this guy is or why he would do this in the first place. And to make matters even worse, I'm pretty sure I have that exact same pair of pants that the porch pooper is wearing. So I may have been burgled by this gentleman. Maybe he broke into my house in the middle of the night, stole my pants, and left a fucking surprise somewhere that I haven't found yet. And now he's wearing my pants while shitting around the town. What's even more disturbing is that the man returned a third time the very next night. Jim got an alert on his phone and tried to confront him, but the man was already gone. You have no idea who this guy is or why he's doing this. I have no idea. Shitting for a third day? A third fucking day. So not, not, not a dual third day you're a third day shitter bro i have no idea we're good neighbors we you know keep to ourselves we behave ourselves and he was visited three times like the ghost of christmas past present and future but the only gift he was given was the gift of a fucking colon cleansing on his front porch and in all three instances captured on the doorbell camera he's wearing the same clothes this guy didn't bathe or change over the course of three shitted. different public shitting incidents. His so, if you didn't bathe, you was just shitting. You, just, you was just shitting. Just shitting. Hygiene stinks. Seriously, what do you have to do to make someone that mad? I, I can't fathom. I can't fathom. Like, you're willing to have crusty booty? He probably homeless. I, bro, why would you make your homelessness worse? That's literally making it worse. Because you know you don't got access to a shower or nothing like that. So you just go shit out in the open when you just can't wipe your ass like that? Like, I, it don't even make sense. 
this guy fucking super sucks. I, I imagine him going around town, he has like this cartoonish stink cloud that follows him around. He is probably unbearable to be near. Holy shit. Jim has now filed three police reports for each night his home has been targeted. These are separate poops. These are separate poops. He comes back and do the same shit every time. Three set. I thought it was just the same clip over and over again. This nigga is really on that serial shitter timing. Oh my god. Nigga went back to back. Nigga was more consistent than fucking Kendrick with the diss tracks. Oh my god. But so far, no arrest. Just a big mess he's now forced to clean up. I'm relieved that he's not violent or he's not trying to force entry. He's just doing his deed. But it's very disconcerting and disturbing. And In Louisville, War Jealous, Wave News. Now, I did wonder if the news broadcast had just repeated footage here when they did the side by side by side because it looks so similar. He goes to pretty much the exact same spot, like down to the middle. What if he is sleep shitting? Like a sleepwalk, but he's taking a shit. What if he's sleep shitting? That'd be crazy. Bro said the homeowner ain't even the doo doo. <laughs> Millimeter, and he spends about the exact same amount of time shitting, which I find to just be highly unlikely, unless this guy is some kind of anus specialist, the butt whisperer, and he's trained his ass to be extremely strict with how long shitting takes. Then it just seems and weird. And he does it quick too. It looks like he's in and out, like no strain, just easy poops that it's pretty much the exact same across all three instances but it is very possible because when he's to debunk myself when he stands up in some of the shitting there he reacts differently so like in one of them he looks at the door and the other one he doesn't and just immediately looks to the left and goes away so it probably is separate instances i just still find it shocking how consistent he was with it same positions same location same duration and same clothing it's like when he's not shitting on this guy's front porch he just enters stasis and then comes back the next night in the exact same outfit and everything it's just so peculiar so yeah, yeah shit, uh, hopefully they catch the porch pooper sooner rather than later i'd hate to see more homes ruined nice by such foul fecal matter being spread haphazardly like this and in, in locations where it shouldn't be so yeah hopefully jim no longer has really to deal shitter, with this bro. porch pooper and i just wanted to make you all aware of this so you can take precautions if you hear a rumbling of a tummy in the middle of the night sprint to your front door asap because you might be <laughs> able to catch the porch pooper yeah so that's about it see ya Alright, man. Hey, W video shut up. I, I would have never found out shit like this if it wasn't for fucking Charlie, man. But hey, man, W video, bro, that shit is crazy. I've never seen no shit like that, bro. <laughs>